Saladino's push for a place on the ballot. Good evening. The GOP picked Rick Lazio to be their candidate for governor. But Buffalo businessman Carl Palladino says he's not giving up the spot on the ballot without a fight. He spoke tonight with News 4's Luke Moretti. Calling himself the outsider, Carl Palladino wants to force a Republican primary for governor and oust the party's designee, Rick Lazio. We're going here to win. To force a primary, the Buffalo developer will need at least 15,000 signatures statewide and at least 100 signatures from half of the state's congressional districts. I'm probably the one person of all the candidates that... that that has the ability to go in and really take on these demons and, and put them down. Erie County Board of Elections Commissioner Dennis Ward says even if Palladino clears all the hurdles and trots across the Albany finish line, change won't be easy. I tend to tend to think that that many people assume that someone can come in and shake up a whole system simply by being an outsider, and I'm not sure the system is that easily shaken. Palladino, who's committed millions of dollars of his own money, also plans to gather enough signatures to create another line on the November ballot. So we're going to have a third-party type line, okay? A th I'll call it a, a Joe Citizen movement type of line uh, to which they can go and, uh, and, and vote. If he's successful and enough people vote for him, Palladino could possibly create a brand new party. If he were to get at least 50,000 votes, even though he didn't win governor, he creates a new party, which will then be on the ballot across the state for the next four years. Palladino says his campaign will now be directed at the Democratic designee, Andrew Cuomo. As for Republican Rick Lazio, Palladino doesn't seem too concerned. He just can't excite people. He, people can't get excited that this man has the fortitude or even the in-depth knowledge of the issues. He just doesn't get it. Luke Moretti, News 4.